channel i am so glad that you are here and i'm so sorry for the delay hopefully i will be getting back on track here pretty soon my daughter just got about two more weeks left of school and if you are new here i would love to have you if you like this kind of content i like to do homemaking cleaning motivation and just a little bit of extra sometimes added in here and there and as you can tell in this video, my house is a disaster. They just got over a stomach virus. Thankfully, I didn't get it, but they did, and it was terrible. And I'm so glad it's over with. But my house looks like a bomb dropped, probably in every single room of the house. And my dishes aren't actually that bad because a few days before, my husband actually cleaned my kitchen for me while I was going to a baby shower and thankfully the next day is when everybody got sick so I just had a few little bit of dishes but everything just got left here and there I mean like I said every room and it does not get all done in this video my living room and kitchen gets done but I just wanted to show y'all what my house really looks like and this is what happens when everyone in your house is sick and your mom and you have to take care of everybody else but either way i just get to the living room and the kitchen and because it takes so much time going with the camera video and everything and i just wanted it done and it took me about two days maybe two and a half days and i don't even get finished with my kitchen and y'all will see what it looks like when i just had to quit because i had to stop and cook supper and you know just do mom things
both couches and the recliner and the main couch well the recliner is the one that gets mainly used the most and my dog will sit lay right here sometimes but not much anymore whenever he comes in the door and when he's wet i'll stick him back in his room but it looks terrible so this is your reminder to clean your couches whether they're leather or cloth because they get dirty whether they're used or not. hang my picture up that was propped up over there and I just took my painters tape and put it where the little you know where the hose was gonna go hold on just a minute and I'm just gonna take my permanent marker and mark it in the holes well where the holes need to go on the wall curtain rods right here this one they actually need to be up higher and they my dogs knocked them down one time so it looks crooked but I'm gonna think of swap it out with this one 
These were the curtains I actually got for my kitchen. But I think I'm gonna go with the same curtains, but I'm gonna order more, but a different curtain rod for the bay windows because this didn't work out like I wanted it to. So um, I'm gonna swap them out with these right here.